Hi, welcome back to first video of chapter six. Hope all of you are in a good health. Today, I'm going to discuss about cell selection, entering spatial numbers, and uh, enter date and time. Previous chapter, you have learned about the how to select cells, enter data, and this chapter we will use the different method to of cell selection and entering data. Now let us discuss cell selection. Entire row, how to select entire row, entire worksheet, adjacent rows and column, no adjacent rows and column, and range of set. Now see. First of all, open Excel documents. You can just the search bar, you just need to write down Excel. And uh, click on the Microsoft Excel 2010 OK. Hey, now I already paint the Excel sheet. First of all, entire row, how to select the entire row? See, I'm just going to click on the row heading for row A. Row one. Now you can see entire row is selected now. Right. And the previous chapter, you have already learned about how to select using the C plus a space bar. We can set, click on any cell of that particular row and Press shift plus a space walk. Now you are able to select the entire row. Another entire worksheet. How to select entire worksheet? You go to the here you can see the icon. Uh, of the select all button. You can see simply select all button here. Once we click on this icon, select all button, able to select the entire worksheet. See, it's the simplest way. Or you can press CTRL control plus a shortcut. We can press CTRL plus A. So this is also we have two ways to we have two methods CTRL plus A or click on the this one. both ways you can select the entire walls. Now see the another question. Adjacent rows and column. How can we select the adjacent rows and column? For this, simply click on the select the first row column, then hold down the shift key and select the last row. Column. See here. Going to going to select adjacent row. Select the first row column, hold down the shift key and select the last column. Shift key, press the shift key, and uh, I just want to select till now here. This way we can select, press anywhere from G to M or this. 
this way we can select the range of cell adjacent rows column another one no adjacent rows and column see click on the this one i just want to select this cell and again this one again a non adjacent cell you can see here now i'm going to select the non adjacent cell this way we can select the more cells using the press control yeah. so you can select any number of cell when you click on the press the control button and mouse click over that so this is also very simple range of cells how can we select the range of cell click on the cell you wish to start your selection from hold the left mouse button and drag the mouse diagonally on the opposite corner of the cell first cell of and shift key press click on the last cell of cell see here. press now press shift key and uh, wherever you just and this will diagonally I have to so now you are able to from a4 to i4 range so click anywhere and diagonally uh, you can select this way you can able to select the range of cell so i hope it is clear the points which i explained entire uh, entire row entire worksheet adjacent row and column no adjacent rows and column range of cell now how to enter a special numbers so when we enter dates and telephone numbers we want them to begin with the zero sometimes but the moment we press enter any key press key the zero is no visible when you press press the enter key to solve this problem just type a apostrophe at the beginning and then type as usual just see i'm just going to enter the date that is uh, 0 9 uh, or we just enter the number 0 9 0 8 once see here, once I'm going to enter the num, press the enter, and you see zero is not there. In that case, what we need to do before going to enter any number, put apostrophe. See, now going to put the apostrophe sign, the left of the enter, keyword you can find out new keyword 0 9 0 and once you press you can see still 0 is there so when you are going to enter a special number press like 0 sometimes we require the code of the std code and this way you can press the enter the special number first of all press the first trophy 09 09 now you are able to so this way you it is very simple when you are going to enter the we also discuss the more features of more how can we use the format update format the next video so i hope the point cell selections entering a special numbers and different ways we can select the entire row entire worksheet adjacent cells and column adjacent cells rows and column no adjacent rows and column and I hope it is clear the points which I explained. Thanks for watching the videos.